Hi, my name is Elena. I am Ukrainian, but I live in Dubai. And I came to Vera Clinic to check my tooth. And they decided to give me some questions and quiz. And I have no idea what am I doing at that point. Hi guys, <laughs> my name is Nick, or Nikita. I'm Ukrainian and I'm in Vera Clinic today, checking out my health, my teeth health. And hopefully I'm gonna be perfect after the, all the treatments right. after all treatments and everything <laughs> yeah no no false false, false. No. no it's Ankara, it's Ankara yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> are we the only one what? who answered this question right <laughs> really <laughs> that's what I was asking him actually on the way here I'm like do you know what is the capital of Turkey no, so he that. knew that <laughs> that's true 100 percent yeah well, no. <laughs> maybe an old town. Maybe maybe an old town, but I don't think so because there is this big one that we saw on the way. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know the name, but I think it's not the tallest one. I think the newest ones, the modern ones, should be taller. However, they could have made it a little bit shorter to make the Galata one the tallest one. Okay, I'll tell. I think it's false. Woo! Logic! <laughs> Team Smarties! <laughs> true. He, he always says it's true. Flossing is good, but brushing I'm not sure. Well, it makes sense because you need to remove all the particles. And they don't stand there, so they don't cause cavity. Probably. I think flossing is good, but it could be false to brush it as many times a day. Yeah. I think it's false, he thinks it's true. True and false. Yeah. Right. False. After 30 minutes. Okay, 30 After minutes. 30 minutes. Oh, so it's partially true. I think so, yeah. because you had a lot of reviews I checked in Google. And we, and and we saw all, a lot of, most of them. Yeah, most of them were about hair transplant. So if you're asking, and you're filming, most likely it's true. <laughs> My favorite thing as a tourist so far was the dinner by the Bosphorus on the rooftop. So, not during this time because it was raining, so we didn't go the previous time so i will definitely recommend you to go and enjoy the view in a nicer restaurant maybe a rooftop maybe drink on the rooftop sometimes it's very nice as far as it's the best and also if you take a ride on the on the boat it's also great yeah all right well we just got picked up from the hotel and it's time to go to the clinic yes we welcome to the vera clinic so how did they, how did we decide to go to Vera Clinic? So first of all, we travel a lot, and a lot of the times we have a layover in Istanbul. And many of my friends they had uh, some kind of clinical procedures or plastic surgeries here in Istanbul or overall in Turkey. And everyone was always satisfied and always happy about it. And it's way cheaper and way more affordable than let's say in Dubai where I used to do my teeth before. And when we started looking for a clinic, we saw Vera Clinic, which had crazy number of reviews in Google and mostly the positive reviews and a lot of um, like a lot of photos on Instagram we always check social media as well so yeah then we chat with the team online and I really like the professionalism they knew English very well they had transportation uh, organized as well so everything felt like it's the right way to do it and then we had a short layover in Istanbul so we went to see the clinic and we went to have a consultation and x-ray and to see the doctors and to see the clinic and after that we finally made a decision that this is the right place to go and yes during this layover we have three days in Istanbul so that's enough time to do all of our procedures so this is how the decision was made and we do not regret it okay so well for me personally it was quality and pricing so you're getting pretty much the same quality as you would get in the US and then you're paid less but then you have a team of professional people and as Helen said previously we travel a lot, we had a layover, it was really convenient for us 
So we pulled the trigger and decided to stay here, decided to do all the procedures here, and we're pretty happy. <laughs> it feels good. The first day was not as comfortable, but the second day was already okay. And also we had a painkiller, so it feels just like normal procedure. It's way better than I thought. I was not afraid at all, honestly. So it's just as I expected, to be honest. Just normal. Yeah, well, well thought and you have to expect that. Surgery is never a thing that you're gonna like or you're gonna enjoy. So you have to deal with this thing. But then at the end, results is what that matters. What I loved about the doctor is that here they were super confident and they've done everything quickly. So you really can feel that they're confident when the, with their instruments or with their tools and they do everything really, really, really quickly. So this is what I liked. Like you feel that they're confident in what they're doing and they know what they're doing. Yeah. So that's, this was quick and this, I think that's what makes your face like less swollen and just because the procedure is going quicker. Yeah, it felt like there was thousands and thousands This was the truth, by the way. She was really quick. Yeah. yeah. It felt like thousands she of people is. were yeah. in that So that's what I like. Chair. Yeah. Because usually it's like you, you sit in there for a few hours and the worst thing is sitting there for a few hours. So you get tired by sitting there. So when it's quick, you know, you just continue your day and you don't think about it. You just, you know, drink a painkiller. That's pretty much it. Yeah. First of all, all of them speak English and this is very important for Istanbul and probably... I, I don't know, like for me, I was surprised because in Turkey not many people speak that well of an English, to be honest. And here everyone speaks English, even like technicians, everyone. And they're very confident and it's, they explain everything really well. And what I loved as well is that the process is so well thought of. They know exactly where you should go, what moment is like. Nobody is confused, nobody is running somewhere. Like it's all by structure yeah, and they tell you what to do. They know exactly what they're doing and it's quick and fast. And as I told before, they're very confident in what they're doing. If we're talking about doctor uh, specifically. She, she was super confident and super quick with doing everything. Even the cleaning was like 10 or 15 minutes. And I did my tooth cleaning before many times and it was way quicker and she felt very more confident than it usually is. And it didn't have any bleeding because usually after, you know, sometimes after cleaning you have bleeding of your uh, gums. This time I didn't have any, which I was really surprised because she was going so quickly, but it was perfect. I didn't have any like swollen gums or anything. So uh, yeah, this is what I've noticed. Yeah, well that looks like a piece of art. made all the fillings. It looks way, way, way better than I had an experience back in Ukraine. It's just another level. Yeah. yeah that's what I would say. I didn't do any fillings, but yeah, I saw his and I can tell that it's like... Yeah, like, well, if you see before and after, it will be surprised. <laughs> I did mine in Dubai, which were like four times more expensive and they look the same as his. So, this is something to consider. <laughs> so, um, my problem was is I had braces before and my teeth were straight, but then my wisdom teeth started to grow. So my front teeth started to like crop, right? How do you call it? They started to overlap each other. <laughs> so for me, it was my first step of removing them and then straightening my teeth again. So I'm so happy I've done it because my jaw is just apparently very small and I cannot see all of them. <laughs> So yeah, I'm super happy. I was dreaming about removing them to be honest and I'm just I'm happy. It was quick, it was easy, it was no brainer. Um yeah, I can I'm super satisfied.